Hey everybody, it's Daryl, and today I'm going to give you a really big tip with the new Divi Theme 3.0, and today we're going to talk about screen resolution and how seriously important it is. Now, a lot of web developers themselves actually tend to overlook screen resolution because they don't really think about it when they're making websites. Now, you see this website right here? It looks pretty good, right? Let's change it on a different resolution. Right now, I'm using around a 2K resolution, so it's very close to 1920 by 1080 but if I change the website, it's gonna look a little bit different. So I'm gonna change it right now to 1600 by 900. And I'm gonna make the site bigger. And now as you can see, the text is overlapping. It doesn't look good. And unfortunately, people actually use lower resolutions than that. So we have to sort of make sure that our website is optimized, even for lower resolution monitors. Now there's two ways you can do this. So this is a text module. You can change this to a, uh, a header or you can contact Elegant Themes and get a custom CSS for it if you don't want to change it. So let me give you an example of how we can fix this. So I'm going to go to my model setting. And right here, I'm going to highlight this and change this to heading one. I also have another tutorial about uh, header text, how important it is, because um, even for uh, mobile and tablet, it will uh, respond, or I'm sorry, it, it will optimize for it. So now you can, you can see that it's optimized for this resolution, but I might want to make it lower than that because you know, 70 pixels is probably better for something lower than 1600 uh, resolution. And people out there still use, you know, 800 by 600 resolution. In fact, on my Google Analytics right here, they actually told me that my website performs the worst on resolutions that are, let me give you the exact number, 320 by 568. Now, that is really bad. <laughs> I don't know anybody on that kind of resolution, but they told me I have a 98% bounce rate on that resolution. And honestly, that's not really my fault. You know, that's not my problem. If they're using something that doesn't even pass a 600 resolution, they must be using a monitor from like 1990, you know, or something really, really old. So uh, that's just the way it goes, unfortunately. So when you're making these websites, make sure you are on a decent size um, resolution, something around, you know, 1800, 1900 by uh, 1080, somewhere around that. But don't go past, in fact, never, ever, ever create a website on 4K resolution it will destroy your life because it's going to look perfect to you so right now i am on 1600 now if i change it to 4k it's going to look perfect it's going to look like the website like oh look the website looks perfect right unfortunately somebody using an 800 by 600 resolution is going to see a different website so you want to make sure that these are optimized by changing them to your header text therefore it will optimize for lower resolutions and it is kind of, you know, I'm a, I'm a techie guy, so I, I do, you know, I kind of don't like it how people still use really, really old computers. I'm kind of like, you know, we're in 2017. It's, it's coming up, you know, you, you know, you, you got to upgrade, you know, so maybe in the future when people use better monitors, uh, it won't be an issue. But as for, as of right now, uh, you want to make sure that your website is optimized for low resolution because a lot of clients contact me sometimes and they say the website looks a little different. And I said, oh, I know why it's because you're using a really, really old resolution. They're like, oh, wow, I didn't know that. In fact, one of the clients I was working with, he said he only had a 1024 max a resolution. And I said, brother, if you're making websites, you're gonna have to get a better monitor or a computer because the um, people will see your website differently on a higher resolution. So that's all I wanted to tell you guys. Uh, remember about resolution, it's very important. Your website will look different depending on what resolution you use. So make sure if you're using the text module to change it to header so it will be responsive. Uh, if you guys have any other questions, Feel free to let me know in the comments section and I will see you all later.